Hi, I'm Peter O'Hara. I am a professional headshot photographer. And I'm here today to talk about why professional headshots are more powerful. So first of all, let's talk about uh, what is a professional headshot. So a professional headshot is uh, a headshot taken by a photographer who solely or almost solely works in headshots. So there are a lot of genres of photographers. Um, you know, wildlife or sports or landscape and each of those has uh, aspects to that genre that are particular to that genre and you know they need to be mastered in order to get what we would call a high-level uh, photo in that genre so headshots are no different um, there's different skills needed uh, to get a great headshot that other genres don't really require uh, one is uh, understanding faces and structures of faces and, um, you know, how to light different structures, different faces, how to light them, how to, how to get the different angles that work for different faces. Uh, there's also posing involved, you know, different body types look better with different poses. So we need to understand all of that. And then on top of that, you know, when a person steps in front of a camera, they typically become someone other than who they really are. This is pretty natural. And, you know, it's the headshot photographer's job, you know, to get that person back to who they really are in front of the camera. And then, but, and on top of that, guide, their, guide them in their, their expressions to, first of all, reveal who they really are. And then, and also do that with like a confidence and a warmth and, uh, and, and in a way that makes them look trustworthy. That this is, all you know uh, what a headshot photographer needs to do and you know it comes out of being good with people and understanding how to how to work with people and different personalities to guide them to the expressions we want so that's that's a pretty big talent that you you will not find in other genres of photography so you know why are professional headshots better than a selfie or let's say a budget portrait budget headshot taken like say at JC Penney's. Well, you know, number one, they show that you take yourself seriously. Um, no one's going to take you seriously unless you take yourself seriously. So it, it shows that you do that. And you know, also, you know, you don't want to look like your high school yearbook photo. You know, that, that was, that was great back then. You didn't care, really care probably what you look like, but now you're in a different ball game. And you want to look the part. And a professional headshot is going to help you do that. Um, it, it shows that you're willing to invest in yourself. And that's important, especially if you're running a business. You know, prospects want to see that you're investing in yourself. It implies that you're investing in your business, which in turn implies that, you know, you're constantly improving things to, to you know, put out a better product or a better service. And that's, you know... That's something people want to see. That's, they, they want to connect with that type of a uh, uh, person. Um, they also show that you have great pride in what you do. Um, let's say, for, for instance, let's say you're uh, shopping for a home. Now, who would you rather work with? Uh, someone who pulls up in a Honda Civic, an, a real estate agent you know, who pulls up in a Honda Civic, or one that pulls up in a Mercedes? It, it speaks about their level of success. And uh, a professional headshot will speak about your level of success and, that, and what you want to portray. So why would I want to pay more for a professional headshot? Well, in addition to everything I've said so far, they are a good investment. Uh, a good investment is something that will return, will give you a return uh, greater than the cost. And I say that a professional headshot's going to do that. It's going to put you um, in that top 5%. You know, I would say, looking at all the headshots out on the internet, I'd say maybe 5% are professional headshots, and it'll, a professional headshot will put you there. You, so you'll raise yourself to the top 5% right off the bat. Um, and, you know, uh, in the long run, it's, it's, it can actually be cheaper. Uh, let's say you get a headshot, you know, a mediocre headshot, and, you know, over time, you realize that it's not speaking, it's not portraying you in the way that you want to be portrayed. Well, then now you've got to go back and, and get it right. So now you've spent 
money on the first headshot and now you're spending money again on the second headshot. So in the long run, it can actually be cheaper to just get a professional headshot from the start. And, you know, this will also, uh, it also gets you noticed above your competition. Like I said, you're going to be in that top 5%. And uh, that's where you want to be. You'll, you'll be noticed there and people will want to work with you. So you know, why, how important is a professional headshot, like really? So, you know, today, uh, due to various aspects of life and what's going on, more connections are made online. And your headshot is the first thing that people see. And they'll make a judgment. As science says that, you know, judgments are made <clears throat> within under a second of viewing your headshot. And science also says that these first impressions tend to be long lasting, meaning they're resistant to change. So uh, what would you rather have? Give a good first impression or you know, give a mediocre impression or maybe even a bad first impression and then have to work at trying to change that impression. It, it's just not, uh, it's not in your best interest. You, you just really want to get that first impression and have it be a good one right from the start. So, you know, wrapping it up, you want to get a professional headshot photographer to do your headshots. Uh, they show that you take yourself seriously and no one else will take you as seriously as you take yourself. That, that's a fact. Um, they're also a great investment. And like I said, in the long run, it could even be cheaper to get a great headshot. And it's that first impression. That's what we're talking about. You want that first impression to be a good one because it tends to be a lasting impression. So that's why I think professional headshots are more powerful. So now that I've said that, um, thanks for watching and now go out and get that great headshot.